Hey, it's Squad. Welcome back to episode of Is and Worth It. So, today's episode at this cool right here, and pretty much what this is is a security bar from the brand called Ace Mining. So, for this bar, you can use it for your window, your doors, and anywhere else to give you guys a little bit more security when you guys do use that. So that way, people can not open your door, or the windows, etc. So, this is what the package looks like when you guys do get it. Let me actually open up to show you guys what the inside looks like. So, once you guys open up, this is what the inside looks like. Let's take it out. So inside we do have one and we do have two and I believe both of them are the same exact thing so then we got like the two pack option they do have this available in the one pack so if you guys only need one then get one instead but inside we do have more stuff so pretty much inside they do probably guys two user manual to teach you guys how to set up and how to use it they probably guys two of these accessories that you can use and both of them are the same and then right here we do have two of them so for these two it's the same exact thing as well so what I'm gonna do is just test out one of them to show you guys what it actually looks like and how to actually use it. So let's open up this one. If you can see how it's all needs to wrap up, so that way it's no it's brand new. So if you guys do open it, this is what the pot looks like. So here's this side, and then here's this side. So for right here, they do have like the non slip material to prevent it from moving around when you guys do use it. And then for this side right here, I believe it's the extendable option for the extended. And it locks in right there. So you do have the option to adjust it in different position or different length. So if you guys want to here, 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 or here, you guys adjust it based on your own preference. If you guys want to bring it down, just push a button right here to release it and bring it down to wherever you guys want. Or you can bring it all the way down like that. And then right here, we do have the accessory. So right to open up. Here are two different accessories that you can use. So for this part, I believe you do have a different option to play around with. So you guys can probably put this right here like that to use it as a uh, mount on the floor. You probably have to push it in or something to lock it in or you can use this option right here to lock it in i believe there's another second here for you to pull out so right there so not only can they extend this part but you have to extend this part right here as well to make it even go even more further if you see so it definitely goes really far but let's say for now if you do want to lock it in right here you guys can use this on your doorknob or anywhere else to actually install it to hold the door to prevent it from opening when you guys do use it. But once you guys do fully lock it and fully open it, this is how far the product is when you guys do use it. If you guys want to make it shorter, feel free to make it shorter like this. So you do have the option to bring it lower and lower. You can see, very easy and very simple. Where the bottom right here is only one hole. So the top one allows you guys to adjust it and the bottom one is just one hole. And when you guys do feel the materials on here, it definitely feels like a high quality material. But both for the top part and also the bottom part, the materials on here is like a non stick material that will give you guys a very good grip when you guys do put it onto the floor to give you guys that security and extra strength. To hold the door and prevent people from opening your door, which is really nice. But definitely the coolest thing is the fact that how it's adjustable so that way to make it shorter or longer based on your own preference. which is really nice and very convenient. So we're bring it all the way back in. This is what the part looks like. So I wanted to right now to actually set it up and show you guys what it actually looks like if you guys were to actually use it on a door or something. And then we'll come back and talk more product in a second. All right, so right here I do have a door. If I try to open it, you can see how it does open. But what I'm doing right now is to set this up onto the floor, onto this door to show you guys what it actually looks like if you guys were to set it up and to show you guys how it does work. So what I'm gonna do is open this part up and pull this part as well. Once you guys got secure, you guys can pretty much set this part up. If you see how right now it's kind of short, so I wanna extend it. So I'm push this part right here and turn it and make it further. Let's try it here. So if I try to open it, I can still kind of open it so it's not fully secure yet. Let me make it a little bit more longer. So this one right here. So I'm gonna push this as far as I can. And this part right here as well. Once you guys got it all set up, if you guys try to open it, you can see how much harder it makes the door to open when you guys do set it up. So the more sturdy you guys make this to be, the harder it will be for them to open it. And see how when I try to open it? It's so hard. And depending on the surface where you guys do set it up, 
the rubber part right here will have that anti-slip or non-slip material. You can see how when I try to open it a little bit, it kind of moves a little bit. So that's something to kind of look out for when you guys do use it. But let me see how I actually give you guys that reinforcement on here. So I do lift it up. If I open it again, it does work. So that is pretty much how you guys set the product. Let me see it definitely does work. And like I mentioned, if you're free to use it on one of these doors, or I can use it like this on one of those sliding doors as well. But this is what the product looks like when you guys do use it. Welcome back guys. So now it's a quick test of product. It definitely actually does work, actually works quite well. If you can see how setup process and everything didn't take that long, once you guys extend it to the length there as one and just stationary onto the floor and onto the door or where you guys want to use it, then you guys are pretty much all set and it does give you guys that extra security. So that actually makes it a lot harder for the person to open the door if they do try to, which is really nice. And the cool thing about the product is the fact that how it give you guys different accessories for your use, whether if you guys want to use like the fork design or if you guys want to use the ball head design like this one, you do have different options to use based on where you want to use it. If you guys want to use it in the door, or if you guys want to use it for like your sliding door for the window door, then use that as well. There's many ways for you to use it. However you guys do want to use it, that is totally up to you guys. But that is everything that's on the product. Now to come boxing and testing product. Now to answer the question of whether or not worth or not. So for this part, I do have to say that it is pretty worth it. If you guys want to need one of these, especially if you guys are in the market looking for a high quality security bar to give you guys a lot more security, whether it's on your door or your sliding door or whatever, then I do have to say that it is pretty worth it. But then obviously for those of you guys who don't want or don't want or have to want these, that way don't buy one and save everyone something else that you do need. So that's basically everything for this video itself. If you guys like this video, make sure to smash that like button in the bottom. That would definitely help this video out. And it will definitely help with the algorithm as well to promote more videos for you guys. So you guys can see more of the videos or similar videos as well. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace.